Huntfish Hoop is back out on the range today. Today we're going to be reviewing the CZ P10C. So if you like what you see today, please like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, and then more importantly, check out our description. We post some links down there for whether it be iPro, EarPro, and then also a link for our website. With the CZ P10C, uh, this is going to be a similar size to most of your, let's say, your compact type firearms from pistols, whether it be like a Glock 19 or your SIG, uh, compact your carry size. With this, uh, you got a 4.1 inch barrel. You have front and rear cocking serrations on the slide there, very deep honed, uh, not too sharp. In fact, especially today, it's cold here in Ohio, so glove-wise, works out really, really well. You have a white three-dot system on here, the extra photoluminescent type on this model. However, CZ sells several different models where you can get optics cuts and things like that, as well as different sights on here. These ones like this, they're very good sights on here though. They have a tactical racking edge here on the rear, which makes it nice if you have to do some form of manipulation off a belt, slide, whatever, you know, whatever it might be. You do have a ambidextrous slide release, slide lever here, so you can release and drop your slide with both sides. Makes that nice. You can take the mag release and you can swap it around for a left-handed or right-handed shooter. And then in addition to that, what's nice about these, these CZ P10Cs here is that they're very, very similar to the most popular pistol ever is the Glock 19. They're very similar, but the, what makes these a little bit better in my opinion is that they give you a lot of upgraded features that you don't often have with the Glock. So you get a better trigger. So the trigger on this is absolutely fantastic. It's not overly light. It's a very good perform uh, duty type trigger for home defense, self-defense type, but it's a nice crisp break, nice crisp reset, it's short and just not a ton of take up in there. And what take up there is, is very light. I'd actually factory type pistol wise, you know, liken it to maybe something like a PDP. It's not as good as that, but it's close. And then also like your shadow systems and things like that. Very, very aggressive grip texture on here, which is really nice. And again, today I'm wearing gloves because it's extra cold today, snowy, but it's a good grip texture on there. You can change out your back straps to help out with that. And then speaking of the grip, the pistol does ship with two steel, uh, 15 round magazines so good mags with that i love steel mags and i am a big fan of them over you know let's say your glock type like that and then you know with this as your front rail section up here i'm able to put a full size light so real nice on there it's a standard 19 13 size slot on there so you're not having to go to your glock size with that trigger guard is squared off on the front but these pistols from cz at the price point these come in come in at andrew picked this up for just south of 500 bucks at the local pro armament store and it's just a really really sweet gun and really guys if you're looking for a gun and you don't want to go break the bank and you don't want to spend over let's say 500 you want to be close to it like a glock 19 range i would buy this as it sits right now over a standard glock 19. so with the cz p10 uh, c here what i will note is that on their extractor here, is they actually have a little loaded chamber indicator that shows out red on there, which is kind of a neat feature. Um, unless, you know, if you're somebody that's into doing press checks, super easy to do with it. But what's nice is you can actually take a look at the side there and you can see that. And you can also see slightly into the chamber and see that there's a round in there as well. Let's run up to that target real quick. I want to show you guys. Um, I have never shot a, a P10C. The P10S, I was really impressed with how easy it was to shoot, how well I was able to shoot it. But the group that I'm looking at right now from about, let's say 10 yards, looks absolutely fantastic. And I want to show you guys. So obviously you're going to see some extra ones in here because we were shooting some rifle earlier today, but I was literally, I just put two mags here. And I mean, outside of this one here and this, all my rounds literally hit, you know, center mass there inside that A zone basically. And 
The pistol is just super accurate, easy to shoot. The trigger on it's fantastic. Just a really, really nice gun and recoil impulse and how it shoots, you know, like let's say like being flat, it really is an awesome shooting gun. Because this CZ P10C, this thing is legit. I'm really, really impressed with it. Really enjoy shooting this. And, you know, from a, I'm probably not gonna be, for myself personally, I'm not gonna be trading my shadow systems in for it because those are a big improvement on Pata Glock. But if you're gonna pick between a standard Glock 19 and this, I frankly would probably be picking this. I mean, it's just, just a really nice shooting pistol and just everything feels good about it. And again, it's another one of those that you can take it, buy it, not have to do a darn thing to it and be ready to rip right out of the box. That is it. The CZ P10C, one heck of a pistol. Just really, really impressed with these. I don't frankly know why we took so long to probably review this or even shoot it in general because I'm really impressed. It's an awesome shooting gun. You know, probably couldn't recommend it enough to somebody looking for an excellent self-defense type firearm or something like that. Just really, really nice gun. Shoots really well. So if you guys like what you see today, please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, and more importantly, go down that description, check out some of the links that we have for our website, some hearing protection, eye protection, stuff like that. But most importantly, after that, follow along next time.